Police enforcement in Rialto, California, has begun using cameras on the cop's lapel. And the reason why they're doing that is because they want to ensure that they get footage of anything that occurs while a cop is on duty. Of course, there's dash cam footage, but a lot of times it's faulty or uh, the cops will do whatever they're doing outside of the frame so you don't really get a sense of what's really going on. And as a result of this, the program has reduced complaints against police officers by 88% during the first year. Wow. Now, Rialto, California is not the only uh, area where this is happening. There are other pilot programs throughout the country. But, of course, this raises some privacy issues. The ACLU says that they are in favor of it, especially when you have all of these different stories about police using excessive force. However, there's the other side of it where people feel that it's a little invasive to have cops uh, on tape throughout the entire day while they're on duty. So I wanted to get a sense of what you think, Cenk. So it's a super serious story, and I love it, and I think it's a great thing. And of course, since I'm an idiot, every time you say on duty, I think. <laughs> what am I doing with this guy? <laughs> okay, all right, now, uh, on to the serious stuff. So first of all, they can turn it off if they're not actually interacting with uh, a civilian. So you don't, they don't have to tape themselves eating donuts with their partner throughout the day. Okay, good, because otherwise it's too invasive on the cops, to be honest. Um, also, if they're, uh, and these are the rules that are being proposed. Also, if they go into someone's house and the person requests that they turn off the camera, uh, they uh, can also do that, right? So you don't invade their privacy. Right. right. Now, the reason that I love it is that obviously 88% speaks volumes uh, in terms of complaints against the police. And the police should be thrilled about that too. Good, there's less complaints, less lawsuits, less everything, right? Um, but it was an interesting point made. It's not just that the cops check themselves because they know they're on camera the whole time. Mm -hmm. But the citizens they're interacting with also check themselves, mm -hmm. okay? So they're like, oh, I'm on camera. If I do something stupid, he's, they're gonna have it on tape. So if, look, normally cameras everywhere drive us crazy, big brother, et cetera. But this is a rare situation where it's actually helpful because it's a check on government. It is a check on government. And keep in mind, whenever taxpayers are paying for the salaries of these government officials or members of law enforcement, we should be able to hold them accountable. We should be able to use footage in order to figure out whether or not they're doing their jobs properly. So I'm in favor of the cameras, but I agree with you. It is a little too invasive if they have it. They have to have it on at all times. This is just the beginning of the, this proposal, so I'm sure that they'll tweak it in a way that works. But I have no doubt in my mind that when it comes to crooked cops, they'll keep that lapel camera off and they'll say something like oh we forgot to turn it on yeah. you know so i'm expecting oh, a lot I of that accidentally as well. put a flower over it cuz i was so friendly that day <laughs> yeah. right so of course there'll be that stuff but then look that's also evidence to some degree yes. right and if that accumulates at least it lets if you have honest uh, supervisors let's you you know that the cop is shady so i, I really think this is a, a good program and Anna made the most important point there we pay their uh, Salary. Salary, so they work for us. So if we say you're gonna have a camera to make sure you're not doing anything wrong, well, a sad day for you. That's what's gonna happen because we're your boss. Wouldn't that be great if that actually worked that way? I mean, but too often, you know, that doesn't work that way at all. And, and there will be a considerable amount of strike back or pushback, I should say, from cops because they don't even want to give you the right to film them on your uh, phones, on your cameras. Um, so they're not going to like this. But hey, again, you're being paid by the taxpayers, and as a result, we got to hold you accountable. Look, that's the thing that should stretch across political lines. Whether you're conservative or liberal, you should love government accountability. Mm -hmm. And that's exactly what this is.